All right, welcome back. Now we're on the note flight page. And the easiest way to start is to go to your left corner, top left corner, and click on Create. Uh, as you can see here, you can create a new score by importing an already existing file or starting with a blank score. Let's start with a blank score. So just click OK. And there you have it. Um, the default blank score is the grand staff, but later I'll show you how to change that. All we're going to do right now is show you a couple of features, uh, and that's really this drop down menu on the left side. So let's click on that. All right, you'll see there's a lot of different options, a lot of uh, musical elements, and you'll notice that some of them have a red check next to them. If they're checked here, this means they'll appear over here um, for easy access. So watch what happens if I click off duration, if I click off pitch and tempo. And so we have less busyness. But you might want that. In fact, it can be very helpful. I'll even click on a few more. There you go. So depending how you want to use this, um, then you can click as many as you need. You'll also notice that if I hover over rhythm, we have a lot of options that aren't um, appearing here. And that's fine. So you just note that there's quite a lot of options with each musical element. All right, in the next video, we'll look at how to uh, go into a little bit more depth on creating a piece. See you next time.